Okay guys, so today I'm going to show you how you can streamline your content creation process while making sure that your SEO strategies are optimized and all of this using a collaboration tool that will allow you to work together as a team on the same blog post. Okay, so let me show you. Okay guys, so let's pretend you're working on this blog post here. So you've come up with all the content, you typed everything, inserted some images, and now you want to optimize this for SEO purposes. So how can you do so? Well, you may have a plugin installed like All-in-One SEO, which is a very popular one. And then you can have a score and try new headlines as well. And all of this can be linked directly to your ChatGPT account. But now you maybe have also third-party tools that you're using for keyword research and things like this. And you might have team members that are more qualified than you as well. So maybe you want to invite them in to help you out optimize this content for SEO purposes. So how can you do so? So let me close this. And right here on top, as you can see, you have Multi-collab. If you click on this, you can see by the side here that we are the only collaborator working on this blog post at the moment. But don't worry, you can easily invite your co-workers to join in and work with you on the same blog post. All you have to do is click on this button here and you can invite any of your teammates simply by using their email address. So let's invite David as an example. And then you can set privileges. So is David a viewer? commenter or co-editor well in this case he has to help us out with the seo so clearly he will be a co-editor and you can also send him a private message so perhaps something like this you know hi dave i need your help optimizing this blog post can you help please thanks and then send the message and as you can see, we got a confirmation that the invitation was sent and this is the email you will receive. So you are invited to collaborate and the title of the blog post. Now to access it, all he has to do is click on this button here and he will have full access without needing any credentials. And now from David's screen, you can start working on optimizing your page for SEO purposes. So he might be using all in one SEO and try a few different headlines to see if we get a better score. So let's try this one. Very good. So this one scores 70 instead of the actual 54. So we could actually change our title here for the new one. Very good. As you can see, now we're scoring 70 out of 100. So now David is going to carry on his work and maybe he's going to look into the general settings here and find a focus key phrase. So he might try a few things. So let's try maybe SEO tips for marketers and let's add our focus key phrase. And now we score 54 out of 100 because obviously we have to insert that seamlessly throughout our whole content. So for this, we'd like to invite John to do so because he's the one who wrote everything. So what we can do basically is to type an inline comment. So let's select this one here, click on this icon here, and now we can type our comment and you can even tag John himself. So if you type at John, as you can see, you can send the message directly to him. And now let's type our findings. So for instance, hi John, I did some research on the focus key phrase. So can you insert this keyword seamlessly into the content? First keyword, second one, third and fourth one. And then you can even assign this to John. So that means that once John is going to take care of this, he will be responsible for marking it as done. So let's post our comment. And now back to John's screen, he can clearly see your message. And now he can work on this and insert all these keywords seamlessly throughout the whole content. And once he's done, he can mark this as resolved. For this, all you have to do is basically tick this box here and then mark it as resolved. And now let me show you another way that you can collaborate on your blog post for SEO purposes. So let's go back to multi-collab. We go to settings and we're going to enable this feature here, suggest edits. So once this is done, we can close this. And now that this is enabled, I can suggest some edits. So let's say, for instance, I notice this keyword here, project management, and this is not optimized for SEO purposes. Maybe I would like to suggest something else. So what I can do is basically highlight this and I'm going to hit the delete key. And as you can see, this one is crossed off and now I can actually suggest another keyword, for instance, SEO purposes. Now, anyone coming along can either accept or reject this suggestion. So let's accept it as an example. And there you go. As you can see, guys, those changes have taken place. And of course, when you have multiple people working on the same blog post, you want to make sure that you can keep track of all the activities taking place. So if you click on this logo again, as you can see who's working on it, we have John Doe and David, and all the activities here are recorded with all the changes made and also a quick summary of all the comments and suggestions. Okay, guys, so thank you for watching. Now, if you are interested and would like to try this out for yourself, we offer a 30 day free trial of our pro plan where you can test all the multi collab features. So for this, all you 
have to do is click on the link in the description below and this will bring you to this page and under the pro heading simply click on this button here now simply enter a few details and that's it you're ready to enjoy the pro version of multi collab for free for 30 days thanks for watching and we'll catch you in the next one